Hey there YouTube. So today I'm going to show you how to resolve this section on your iPhone which takes up a lot of space. As you'll notice when you sync your iPhone you sometimes have this section which is called other which takes up a really lot of space on your phone. So the real question is how do you get rid of this? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you with a couple of uh, apps how to bring this number down considerably. So first things first what you need to do is you need to get to your iPhone which I'm gonna do now and there we go alright so there's my iPhone alright so first things first what we need to do you need two apps here first thing you need to make sure you got Cydia so you need to make sure you're jailbroken so let's go into Cydia and now there will be two apps that you need to get the first one I'm gonna show you is called uh, iCleaner okay the one you want is iCleaner Pro and this one you can get from the Insanely repo um, if you want to support the guys you can probably get it from uh, iCleaner Pro I think it is gone free now anyway um, but I will show you where the the repo to get it so the first one you want is iCleaner Pro um, the repo that you need to be getting this from is uh, you go to sources let's just wait for this so what you'll do is, okay, let's go to sources and you will go to edit, add, and you will add the repo, repo dot in same, the I dot com, you'll add it. I've of course already added it, there it is. And in this repo, you can basically get iCleaner Pro and uh, the other one that you need to get is called cache clearer okay so once you've installed both of them first thing we're going to do is your device will obviously respring first thing we'll do is run iCleaner Pro what you do is you go into the app and basically very easily this will clean your device of any log files any cache files any unnecessary information or data that's on your phone that's making up that other portion so there's even over the air software updates that you can clean there's safari there's attachments there's a lot of cool stuff and you can of course exclude certain apps so if you want to for example exclude your camera exclude whatsapp and certain things like that you can also do it from here so very simply you just press the clean button on the top right and there you go it's easy as that uh, you can also press the analyze button uh, i've already uh, run this quite recently but i think by analyzing it it should tell you how much space it is available uh, to clean on your device um, and the other app I'm going to show you is called Cache Clearer. So, um, sorry, that one needs to go. Okay. Okay, let's quickly check. So, it's finished analyzing, it's processed some files. So, there's approximately 310 meg that I can save if I were to run it now, which is cool. I'm not going to do that right now, but you should press clear if you want to clean your device. The next one we need to go to is called cache clearer so what cache clearer is very simply is you go into your settings once you've installed cache clearer now just to remind you you go into Cydia you go to search which I will show you now search search for cache clearer okay you install this again from insanely now there's no app that it actually installs what you need to do to access it is you go to settings and in settings you'll go to general storage and iCloud usage and then you got to manage storage what you get here is a list of all your apps of course but if you click on that app you'll see two new options come up reset app and clear apps cache by doing this you actually clear up all the unnecessary information in certain apps um, what's very cool is you can actually reset the app as well so reset it means that it deletes everything relating to the app so it's basically like reinstalling it from fresh um, so it becomes very useful when you've got like you want to clear up your web browser or you running Puffin browser or a lot of uh, you know any app that's caching a lot of data so that's the way you basically clear it up once you've of course uh, gone through this process you will then notice when you sync your phone with iTunes again that you have cleared up a really lot of space great guys thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe ciao